I remember the defining moment was 1968 when Padre Pio died. I went for the prayer service and people were putting petitions in the box. And the facilitator said, uh, young man, why are you here? Why don't you put a petition? Padre Pio will answer your prayers. So I, I, I wrote a simple petition. Dear Padre Pio, please give me a sign that God is calling me because I'm going to invest my whole life in the church. Is it worth it? Will I leave halfway? Will I be disillusioned? Padre Pio, I want to be happy. Give me a sign. If you give me a strong sign, I'll say yes. That night, I had a dream. I dreamed of Padre Pio. He appeared to me in a dream. I said, are you Padre Pio? He said, yes. I said, but you are dead. He said, my son, there's no such thing as death. I said, why are you here? He said, can you celebrate the Mass? I started laughing. I said, Padre Pio, I'm not a priest. How can I celebrate the Mass? He said, if you say yes, then you'll be a priest. Can you say yes now? I said, yes. He said, then, join the priesthood. He said, can you go out in the sanctuary? The people are waiting for you. This was in my parish, Our Lady of Perpetual Succor at Sigla. So, I went and stood at the sanctuary. I stared at the people. I panicked. I sat at the front pew and I waited. Because nobody was coming along. He appeared again. And he called me John Boy. My name is not John Boy. I stood up. He said, why did you run away? I said, Padre Pio, I'm scared. Look at the crowd. I can't even speak. I'm so nervous. He said, John Boy, I'll be with you. Can you say yes again? I said, yes. So Padre Pio said to me, I'm going away. I said, Padre Pio, I'll get a taxi. He said, no, I'm going to heaven. You don't need a taxi. I said, okay. And I got up. I looked at the clock. It's 4 a.m. That evening, I went for Mass. And the Gospel was, Simon, son of John. John boy, do you love me? I was holding my football. I came late and the parish priest, who later became Bishop Nicholas Cha, was staring at me. Second time, Simon Peter, do you love me? I looked up, he looked at me, I put on my head. And the third time, I knew that gospel on John Boy was for me.